welcome to two projects in this video we are going to explain the project a study on blockchain application in donation platform introduction the primary objective of this project is to transform the conventional donation management system by harnessing the capabilities of blockchain technology traditional donation platforms often operate within a centralized framework this centralization grants administrators complete authority over donor and transaction data creating vulnerabilities that can be exploited for alterations and misuse to overcome the inherent limitations of centralized systems we are introducing blockchain technology as a secure and transparent alternative blockchain is like a digital ledger that records transactions securely and transparently instead of having all the data in one place blockchain stores records as blocks of data each with a unique code called a hash these blocks are distributed across multiple computers or nodes making it much harder for anyone to tamper with the data or compromise the entire system blockchain offers several advantages first it is decentralized meaning the data is stored in one vulnerable location second it enhances security because the data is stored in encrypted format that is very difficult to alter or hack third it promotes transparency as all transactions are recorded and visible to authorized users fourth it ensures data immutability meaning once something is recorded in the blockchain it can't be easily changed finally it is resilient to failures because even if some nodes go down others continue to maintain the data Ethereum is the chosen blockchain platform for this project. It introduces the concept of smart contracts which are like digital agreements that run on the blockchain. These smart contracts enable secure execution of donation processes making Ethereum an ideal choice for our donation management platform. Objective of the project. So as I mentioned earlier, the primary objective of this project is to harness the potential of blockchain technology to ensure that donations and donor information are handled securely and transparently by utilizing blockchain's unique features such as unchangeable records and decentralization the project aims to instill trust and reliability in the management of donations to achieve this goal the project intends to incorporate smart contracts into the blockchain system Smart contracts act like digital agreements simplifying the storage and retrieval of donation data by eliminating the need for intermediaries these contracts reduce the chances of errors or manipulation in the management of donation information and the project will employ the Django framework a well established web development tool to establish a secure and transparent donation platform within this platform features like user authentication donation management and administrative functions will be seamlessly integrated and another crucial objective of this project is to create a solution that can scale efficiently this means the system should be capable of accommodating a large number of users who can sign up make donations and access donation related information securely Requirements needed to execute this project are hardware requirements processor of i5 and above ram of 8 gb and above rom of 25 gb and above software requirements needed are node.js python 3.7.0 and visual studio community version to execute this project we have designed few modules the first module is admin login in this module administrators enter their credentials to access the platform with special permissions once logged in they can manage donation activities see donor information and ensure transparency the second module is new user sign up in this module new users create accounts by providing a username password and necessary details this makes them official platform members allowing them to access in donation activities the third module is user login This module is for registered users to securely access their accounts by using their username and password. Once in, they can make donations and check donation history. The fourth module is donate here. This module simplifies the donation process for registered users. They choose the donation type, provide details about what they are donating and submit. The donation information is securely stored on the blockchain for transparency. And the last module is view all donations. This module lets users see a list of all donations including their own and others. It helps users track their contributions and understand the impact of donations in the community promoting transparency and trust. Blockchain integration. 
We integrated blockchain technology to establish a secure repository for storing and managing donation data. By utilizing blockchain's decentralized and tamper-resistant nature, we ensured that donation information remains safe from unauthorized access and alterations, fostering a trustworthy environment for managing contributions. And smart contracts played a crucial role in our donation management system, facilitating data retrieval from the blockchain efficiently. These smart contracts enhanced transparency and trust in how donation data is accessed and managed, providing users with confidence in the accuracy and reliability of donation records. And the SHA-256 algorithm that is Secure Hash Algorithm 256-bit is utilized to verify the integrity of each donation transaction. Each block in a blockchain is linked with a unique hash code. These blocks are maintained across multiple nodes or servers. Before storing new records, blockchain verifies the hash code of each block. If any block data is modified, it results in a different hash code, triggering security alarms and ensuring the integrity and immutability of the data. Execution of the project To execute this project, first we need to open the code folder which contains the project source code files. So this is blockchain donation folder. Inside this folder are python code files that are intended to be dynamically loaded into the project during runtime. This is blockchain donation app folder. This folder comprises a static folder which contains files related to CSS, JavaScript and Bootstrap. These files contribute to the visual and interactive aspects of the application. Blockchain donation app folder also contains a templates folder. Within this folder, we'll find all the HTML pages used throughout the project. It includes pages like index.html, home.html and more representing various sections of the website. And it also contains Python code files that will be executed during the runtime of the application, supporting its functionality. This is hello eth folder. Inside this folder, I have a node modules folder. This folder consists of dependencies or modules needed for the project. Now open .bin folder. This folder often contains executable scripts related to the project's dependencies. So I have a run blockchain.bat file here. Double click on it to start the blockchain. This script will initiate the local Ethereum blockchain for development purposes. It contains commands to start the blockchain environment. Now the blockchain is hosted on the local machine at the local host and the port. This address allows us to interact with the blockchain using various tools and applications. Now execute the command truffle space migrate to compile and deploy the smart contracts. So I'm typing truffle space migrate and hit the enter button. So truffle is a development framework for Ethereum that simplifies the process of compiling and deploying smart contracts. They are deployed on a blockchain network and can facilitate various transactions such as transferring tokens or managing digital assets. Once the migration process is complete, Truffle will provide us with a unique Ethereum contract address. This address, so this is the address. This address represents the location of the deployed smart contract on the blockchain. And this is the gas used. To execute the Solidity file and compile smart contracts, this is the amount of gas consumed. Now minimize this. This is donation contract SQL file. This file consists of Solidity code. It handles data structures, functions and events with modifiers for validation. This is manage.py file. It is a command line utility that comes with Django. It provides various commands for managing Django projects including tasks like running the development server, creating database tables, applying migrations, and more. And this is run.bat file. Instead of executing the project through command line interface, we have created Windows bat file to execute the project. Now double click on it to start the Django application. So the Django framework will host the application locally at the default address, local, host, and port, unless configured differently. Now copy the local link provided by the framework. I'm copying it and paste it into any web browser. I prefer Chrome. After pasting it, type index.html at the end and hit the enter button. So the home page of the project has been displayed in the browser. This is the front end built using the Django framework. And here we can see admin, user login and new user sign up links. So if you are new users, we have to register first. Click on new user sign up link, fill in all these details and click on register button to sign up. So the username would be 
navin give the password give the contact number give the email id give the address so after filling in all these details now click on register button in the red color text we can see sign up process completed now we we'll log in click on user login link so give the previously mentioned credentials username and password and click on login so we have logged in as navin and here we can see donate here view all donations and logout links click on donate here link so here we can see a donation screen select the donation type from the drop down whether it is cash property ornaments or home items i'm selecting home items and the donation description would be donating a tv to orphan home so after selecting the donation type and giving the donation description click on submit button in the red color text we can see donation details saved in blockchain so the details have been saved to blockchain now click on view all donations link so here we can explore a comprehensive list of donations including contributions made by others so we can see our donations and also other donations now click on log out now we we'll log in as admin click on admin login so give the credentials username and password of admin and click on login so we have logged in as admin and here we can see a get donation details from blockchain link click on it so here admins can access user details for all individuals involved in donations so we can see donor name donation type description and donation date so similarly any number of users can sign up and contribute now click on log out button so the conclusion here is we effectively use blockchain to boost security and transparency it safeguards donation data while making sure no one can tamper with it this means donations are secure and everyone can trust the records we made sure the platform is easy to use anyone can log in donate and check donations with ease this encourages more people to get involved our system empowers administrators with robust tools to monitor and manage donations effectively this not only ensures transparency but also upholds accountability and administrators can oversee donation activities view user details and keep an eye on the donation process ensuring a fair and honest environment we have designed our solution to be scalable capable of accommodating a growing user base and increasing donations and by successfully demonstrating the feasibility of integrating blockchain technology into donation platforms we have paved the way for broader adoption within the sector for more projects please visit our website www.trueprojects.in for updates on latest project videos please visit true projects youtube channel and subscribe